So I had been probably working uh, in the country music and had my music out on radio and um, kind of having a moderate success in the genre for a, a year before I kind of had major red flags raised to me. I was in rural Saskatchewan doing a gig and I had brought my parents along with me and uh, a designer by the name of uh, Misty Natalhau had designed a, a beautiful denim jacket with um, indigenous print on it. And I wore that on stage and I was very, very proud and I thought nothing of it. I just went on stage and did my thing, came off stage and I'm sitting around with my mom talking and, and two men came up to us and we, <laughs> I guess me just uh, having that uh, after show kind of buzz going on and I'm just in a great mood. I, I kind of thought they were coming over to say, you know, great job, buddy, you know, see you around sort of thing. And they actually ended up saying to me and my mom, I would be careful about wearing uh, things like that around here. Uh, people like you might get shot. And I was horrified. I was absolutely horrified. And my mom wanted to, make a big thing of it and kind of uh and kind of tell people about the situation but I was so scared that I just said you know mom let's not talk about it let's let's just kind of keep this to ourselves it might have just been an isolated situation but in talking to other indigenous artists and to other lgbtq artists I realized this isn't an isolated situation this these are things that we face daily in the workplace our workplace being the genre in itself and and gigs that we play and people that we have to interact with I definitely think if, if someone wants to help mend the situation and help bring the genre forward, I think that everyone needs to start having these very uncomfortable, these very uncomfortable conversations because they are uncomfortable and they're uncomfortable for the people in the people being um, treated the way that we've been treated. It's uncomfortable for us too. And it's important that we keep talking about it because the more we talk about it, the more it comes to the surface, the more that we can start healing, the more that we can stop making the same mistakes that we're making over and over and over again.